They are 40, let's go! So it's the beginning of a new week, which means the reputation rewards have reset, which means I can finally get the teleport waypoint. And this is important since this means that Sayu can effectively have Pyro anywhere on the map. So definitely will be interesting to see if I can get the Dragon Spine rewards and kill the Snowball King. Let's talk about AR40. AR40 is a really important part of the game since this is where the 5 star starts to come in. Now even though it's possible to tackle artifact domains and start grinding for the 5 stars, we are not going to do it until it's AR45 since that's when the 5 star artifact drops are guaranteed. At least, this is what I know based on my understanding of how artifact domain works. I haven't really thought about which domain I'm gonna farm though, um, but definitely it'll be a topic I'll come back to in a future video. Ah yes, also, um, Ito banners coming definitely rolling for him i've been saving up primal gems for the past few weeks so when the day comes it's gonna be a massive wishing festival well not really massive but you get the point rip I'm aware of the chances of getting another Claymore billet is basically zero, but if I do get another Claymore billet, that would be nice. I believe Ito's banner is based on defense, so it would be nice if I could get another white blind for Ito. Again, I could be wrong, I have never used Ito, at least not outside of the trial run, so I know basically nothing when it comes to Ito. But again, the time will come, and that's when I will be using him. Ooh, I'm not sure if... Ooh, that's good, that's good. And everything is just... Okay. Alright, so anything beyond level 6 I don't really need, since they are mostly just cosmetic stuff. I guess we could get 10 spikes of weed for Timmy, and then uh, we'll do the bounty some other time. Now, for anyone wondering why I took just one of the weekly quests, the reason being is I want to conserve the reputation stuff. For Lire, but there is a chance that by the end of the week I still wouldn't have touched Lire. So if that's the case, I will come back here and complete the monster reputation stuff. Alright, I can't believe I forgot to do this rogue quest. This is such a simple rogue quest, but hey, that's the 20 AR XP that I need. And just like that, we are at reputation level 6. Wow! Okay, so that's the fox chest done as well. So that's Crimson Agate 79. The last remaining Crimson Agate is the one from the Snowboard King. Okay, so let's get the teleport waypoint. And the next step is to go to Monstart. And let's just quickly swap to Sayu and move to the kitchen. And let's see if the teleport waypoint keeps the pyro. Yes. It does. All right. Let's just get these words out. And there we go. The snowball king. Okay, okay, okay. This is not going to be an easy fight. All right. We are going to have to go all out on this. Oh, yeah. There we go. Yep, yep, yep. So we needed to hit the wall a few times so that it stuns itself. But we can't do it too many times though because um, otherwise it'll go into the rage mode. Okay, no, okay, hasn't done it. Why, why? This is the most awkward fight ever. Oh, oh no, oh no, oh no. Okay, so we are kind of dying from the cold, so we need to- Oh my god. <laughs> oh my god, that is um interesting. Oh my god, oh my god. That rage, dude. No, 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 no. No, well, yeah, what the f- Oh, no, 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 no. Okay, we need to get rid of this guy before it's too late. Oh, no, 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 oh my god. What is that? That fight is so scuffed. And there we go. Crimson the Gate 80 complete. Yeah, um, I don't need this. Uh, I guess let's just get it up to level 10 anyway. All right, so basically anything beyond level 10 is just for the basic rewards. There's no wishes to be unlocked or anything like that. So I guess you'll probably never hear from Dragon Spine again unless... Oh, wait, the chest. I can't believe I'm actually doing this. Wasting a portable waypoint for what could be two primal gems. Or maybe five if it's an exquisite chest. But I guess five is better than zero. So I guess let's just get this done and over with. Yes. Oh, it is five. A pleasant surprise. I thought it was two. Three more than what I've bargained for. So I've heard from you guys, I could try using the ball to hit the barrels, and I've actually not tried this yet. 
Okay, so let's start by breaking down the barrel. And let's pop the shield. Um... Yeah, it looks like it's a bit too far for the ball to hit. Alright, so let's see if there's any luck from up here. Hmm... Yeah, um, I'm not even going to try. It's too high. Thanks for the idea though. Appreciate the comment. So we're missing just one chest and two CDs. The two CDs, I have no idea where I'm supposed to get it. And the one chest that I'm missing is the time challenge. But considering the fact that I was able to collect everything else in Dragon Spine, I'm actually really happy with my progression. I mean, for the most part, Sayu carried our ass around, but I did spend a lot of time to get Sayu, so it is what it is. Uh, let's look at Razor's Ascension. What does he need? Alright, 12 of the mask. Let's get that done. What? Oh, wait. Alright, that should be... Yeah, okay, that is enough. Okay, and that's Razor's Ascension done. Let's get him up to level 80. And let's not forget the free wish. Oh, wow. That's 10 wishes now. But I'll do them some other time. Ah, yes. I forgot. I pre-farmed. Well then, I guess since we are here, we might as well just up the talents. Why not? <laughs> oh wow, that took all of my Helitro mask. Well, it's fine. The ENQ aren't that important. It's the normal attack that really requires my attention. Okay, yeah, and let's just make more for next week. Yeah, and I need some defense dishes. Oh rip, no crabs. Well, I guess let's just do some of the stamina ones. Bruh. Seriously? Alright, and what does Beidou need? Huh? Alright, that's not that bad. Rip, that's all my Hidichon mask gone. Oh yeah, and this as well. And Noel level 70 coming right up. And I believe the weapon as well. I already pre-farmed it. Yep, I did. And a Beidou. What about Beidou? Oh, uh, what? So he needs your mask as well? What the f- Bro, I'm out of he needs your mask. I guess I need to kill a few. Are you serious? Uh, you know what? It's fine. Future me will deal with this. At least right now, it's enough to get Beidou's weapon to level 70. So that's the levels all sorted. Well, I guess since this is the only one left, it's time. To return to the spiral abyss. Um, Razor and Noel first half, second half we have Beidou, Chongyu, and Sayu. So as I mentioned previously, Razor and Noel synergizes quite well together since Noel can protect Razor even during his Q time when his health drops into the reds. And I guess the second team is just everyone else. Sayu is gonna be the healer, Chongyu and Beidou maybe we could work something out with the superconduct. I mean we've only got 5 characters and I guess we are only trying to finish for 5. It should be okay. Okay. okay, so that first half wasn't that bad. What I'm worried about is this half. Oh, what? There's only two of them? Well, um, alright then. Oh, no, 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 do not, do not, no, 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 no. God, that attack deals a lot of damage. We are not risking it. Wait, six minutes? So we could spend two minutes on the first and uh, two minutes on the second? Oh, all right. That's not that bad. Oh, yeah. And, uh, and I remember it's both just treasure quarters. So we should be fine for this one. Just need to make sure that before the end of the chamber, we get the energy up. Otherwise, chamber three might be a problem. All right. So as expected, first half's done. And I think that took less than a minute as well. So we have three minutes to just screw around here. So I'm going for the ones that do ranged attacks since the melee ones, they tend to try to group up on you anyway. So you can use this to your advantage to deal collateral damage. I don't think this is going to matter that much right now. But once you get to the lower chambers, then these things will start to matter. Or you can just debate your way through infinite five stars. Oh wait, I forgot the energy. I, I was just kind of autopiloting through the die. <laughs> but it should be fine. Floor 3 isn't that difficult. I recall it's like a dodge chamber, so there isn't that many enemies. You just have to kill them quick before they deal too much damage. Yeah, and that's it for floor 5. It went exactly how I thought it would go. Uh, and I guess let's just do floor 6, cause chapter 9 does require you to finish floor 6. So let's do that. 
Oh my god, Whopper Flowers. Actually, now that I had a look at it, why is it 120 seconds? So we have four minutes to defeat 17 enemies for each chamber. That does make this floor a lot easier to work with, so... All right, 6-1 down, 6-2 next. Oh boy, 26 enemies and I have... I do not know how much time. Is it, is it a bit more than five minutes? It's like five minutes and 30 seconds, is that is that right? A lot of it is just going to the ranged enemies and killing them quickly and killing the shamans before they deal any damage. So if you know which enemies to fight, everything else isn't that bad. And again, we have no well that's just kind of there to tank the damage. And we actually want Razor to have less than 70% health due to the four-piece berserker set kicking in. So as long as he's alive uh, and has less than 70% HP. He's actually dealing more damage than he's supposed to. So this doesn't really bother me too much because as I said, Noel is just being the ultimate fail save for Razor, especially when he's on the kill. It's just that the second half is going to be the one that I'm really worried about. Oh boy, 27 enemies this time. <laughs> All right. Yeah, okay. I don't think I'll be able to get the three stars for this chamber, but that's all right. As long as we get the six stars, we can progress to the next floor. And as far as the adventure handbook goes, floor six is the last one on the list. I mean, it, I could be wrong, you know, maybe in a year's time, there's going to be update to the adventure handbook. But as of right now, it's floor six three. So as long as I finish floor six. And again, uh, we can always come back here once I get Ito. He's going to be the DPS for one of the chambers as well. So that Beidou and Chongyu can do their support roles better. Because right now, Beidou, I'm not saying that Beidou is weak, but Ito will be a really strong addition in our team. So it's only a few days now. Can't wait to get him. And that's it for 6-2. And holy crap, I got 3 stars. Um, I'll take it. I guess as long as we complete this final chamber, we'll be able to do floor 7. I'll think about it. I might not do it. I might do it. Future me will decide. Oh boy. Big guy. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, we can just use Noel to get rid of the shield. And then Razor can do the rest. And just a casual swap to the map. You're not meant to be able to do this, but hey. It is what it is. Well, I guess that's the first half done, just the second half left. And we've got like three or four minutes in order to get the final star. So I think we got this. And it's just a bit majors as well, so... Alright, we got this. We got this. I didn't think that I was gonna 9 star this, but I think we got this. Alright, so that's floor 6 done. I guess we can just go on to floor 7 and see what happens. Okay, so a bit is done, chapter 8 done, now chapter 9. Okay, yep, I've already done a good amount of these. Yep, Spiral Abyss is done as well, and the sigils, I've already done them. Okay, so just these four left. I could definitely do them in due time. Yeah, mm, yeah, I could do these later. It's fine. It's not that big of a deal right now. All right, just checking real quick. Okay, uh, flower. I remember there's a yeah gladiator feather. I don't have a five star feather. And then yeah, defense attack attack. And here I've got attack as well. And for yeah, okay, I don't have the four piece gladiator. So the four piece one, I'll just have to do it later. And what are these pieces? All right, and Sayu, yeah, the uh, scholar and Exile is as good as it's gonna get. Same goes to Chong Yun and as well. And Noel, uh, yeah, this is already. I think the shield needs to change. The shield will need to change soon. But I'll only change it if I'm actually struggling. And then Razor still got his four piece, and Beidou still have her four piece as well. And uh, I guess since I need to put talent, I need the treasure insignias, but. I I guess I need to up Beidou's normal attack since she needs to deal um, physical DPS as well. It's not preferable, but I don't have a choice. I could wait until you eat Ito, but I just want to test the water, see how fast I can go into the abyss. So I'm willing to invest a little resources into Beidou, even though it's not optimal. Okay, so that's only enough for two levels, but it's better than nothing. It's just for fun. And yeah, let's go back to the abyss. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Ooh, crit rate. And a feather. I mean, a fl fl <laughs> Oh, Beto, we are getting an immediate upgrade right now for the extra crit rate. It's about time, really. Crit rate is just too good to pass off, so you, you have to do it. You have to do it. What is with these substats? It's so bad. But you know what? I don't have a choice. I really need the crit rate. 
There yeah, really isn't a lot I could change, but I guess, um, mm, I guess we could do two piece berserker and two piece gladiator just so that we have a more consistent attack. I guess we could get this piece to level 16 and leave it there because getting it to level 20 is just way too much. Yeah, um, I guess we'll try that. It's more consistent than the four piece berserker because Beidou don't usually go under 70% HP. Like, it doesn't even need to be good, it just needs to be there right now. In the future, we could get better pieces and swap them. Okay, so we got Pyro, Hydro, and Electro on the first half. So that means that we might need to swap the teams around. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, this is not good. This means I have to fight the Ice Guy with the shield out all the time. This is where having a Pyro like Diluc or Xinyang will come in extremely handy. But, well, I guess that's not happening. Beto can at least parry, so it's not that bad if I get hit. But Chong Yu is uh, really kind of useless here. Really? This time with an Electro Guy? Wow. I mean, we are not 3 starring this. Like, that's definitely not happening. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. Baylor, please don't die. Please don't die. I kind of need you alive right now. Ooh, one more hit. No, God. Oh, my God. Every everyone's dying. Everyone's dying. So are you actually being the saving grace right now? Because without her, I would be dead ages ago. Oh, finally. That took way too long. I can't wait to get destroyed on the second half. Okay, just these two. All right, I can deal with this. This isn't bad. We've got Noel who can pretty much generate infinite shields with her Q. So if you are in a sticky situation, we could just pop Noel's Q and we'll be good. Oh, no, 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 no. Uh, okay, now nah, I have to do it. I have to do it. I don't have a choice. Oh my God, I need 10 seconds. 10 seconds to get the two stars. Oh, can I do it? Can I do it? Oh, I'm not too sure about this. Oh, I'm not. Okay, it. raise up, go. Can I do it? Oh, yes. Yes, let's go! Let's go! Now we just need to keep the two star pace for the rest of the two chambers and we'll be able to do floor eight. Not that it's like a big deal or anything, I can always come back to it later, but if I do it now, it's just like a added plus, I guess. There's a certain charm to completing the abyss early, just so that you get an earlier reward. And I guess if it's for floor 12, you can flex the card for no real reason, but hey! <laughs> But I don't think I'll be getting to 412 anytime soon. I need to hit AR45 and do the artifacts domain. And I really need to get Ito. Like a 5 star DPS for the second team. The first team I could get away with just Razor and Noel. But the second team is like missing this one big DPS guy. But of course if there's any other 4 stars I'm missing, I would love to get it. Mainly Sing Yang because that's the only 4 star that I'm missing. Again, another Pyro. So definitely will be helpful. Especially her shield as well. Increases the physical DPS. As definitely will be worthy for Razor. But then if that happens, I might need to swap teams around and get more play mobility for the defense. But again, it's not like I could get play mobility on demand. Oh, but may maybe. I think Inazuma might have a few opportunities, but we'll see about that. And also this chamber is a lot easier because there's no Hydro guy. And that's first half done. And I'm starting to think that maybe it's just the first chamber is a bit hard because I don't have a pyro character. I remember distinctively, floor 7-3, you have to finish it in like two minutes. Like, you it's really it's a really fast domain. You just need to burst your damage and just get everyone out. So as long as I get this done and sorted, we should be able to hit floor 8. Whew. Okay, so that's 7-2 done. There's one more wave, a burst wave, get everything out and we'll be good. This floor is mainly to teach you on the elemental shields on the platoons. Normally, you'd have a power character to work with, but of course, you know, this is a challenge. We want to progress the game as much as possible with only the Claymore characters. So it is understandable that I have to deal with these extra levels of BS. <laughs> yes, I call it BS, just so that we could complete these domains. But of course, it's all still possible. So it is what it is. So I guess that's the fun aspect of the challenge, you know, trying to overcome stuff that you're not meant to because Claymores. And that's it for floor 7. We got 8 stars. We are missing that 1 star from the first chamber due to the cry roll. So we will have to come back to it. But I can't believe we are at floor 8 already. It's actually kind of um, unusual. I wouldn't say it's insane because there are people that have gone further down in the abyss with lower adventure ranks. I'm fully aware of it. But nevertheless, even with just claymores, I still think that we are doing some crazy progress here. But I genuinely believe that floor 8 is going to be the limit. 
Anything beyond Fallout 8, the team with Beidou is just way too behind and we might not be able to hit the required DPS. Not saying that it's completely impossible, but it's improbable. And I believe we'll just leave it as it is. Oh my god! Oh my god! 36! I saw it! 36 HP! <laughs> I really should be dead. Sorry, please heal up. Oh my gosh, that was way too close. Alright, now it's time for A2. Now, A2 is an interesting chamber because this is the most scuffed chamber in terms of the star distribution. I mean, I don't really understand why 2 star and 3 stars are within 60 seconds. It could have been 60, 180, and 300 like any other chamber, but no. You're doing this 180, 300, and 360, which makes it incredibly hard to get these 2 stars. I remember the first time I did the Abyss, I did not get any star for A2. It took a lot longer to 3 star A2 into 3 star A3 or A1 or any other chamber. A2 was just a weird oddball chamber all right so that's eight two complete we've only got one star but that's mostly because the rune guard has a lot of uh, physical resistance so there's nothing much we could do about it all right so for floor eight three is really only just two monsters and the only reason why it's only two monsters is because one of the achievements requires you to dodge every single one of these attacks so it's like uh, i believe if it's uh, down to dodge you have to like not take damage for like two three five three and eight three that's why these chambers are a lot easier i would have at least pretended if this was going to be an epic battle but no it is not an epic battle it is just two regis wines that i need to heal so that is the spiral abyss complete well at least the normal one there's also the moon spiral abyss but i don't think i'll be beating that anytime soon bro uh okay Ooh, crit rate oh that's good this is good i'm keeping that and uh what else do i have here Oh, bro. Uh, okay. And yep, so that's the Moonspire unlocked. And just free Primal Jams. I'm only going to try this once. If I fail, we are done. Right? <laughs> I'm not doing this. I'm not doing this again. I know we're going way too far. I'm not even supposed to be done with the Abyss. Yet I'm here. So let's just take this as a meme attempt and be done with it. I swear, if I somehow make it to this floor, I'm just be like, bro, what the heck am I doing? <laughs> Alright, okay, fine, fine, we're done, we're done, nope, no more.